Welcome back to Button Smashing. Welcome back to the Voodoo Warriors. Playing some Chroma Squad while my sister is away and we're reading some messages right now. How's everybody doing? I hope everybody's having a very good time because I'm enjoying the hell out of myself with this right here. What a forgetful uncle you have, Flashy. We haven't talked since the studio's opening. How are things at my warehouse? Hope you have all the space you need. I told Joe to fix that leak in the bathroom next Friday. Oh, and make sure to feed that cute little cat that lives around the place. She has been there since I brought in the Cerebro device last summer. Probably snuck into the box or something like that. Cats are always nice to have around. Hope the little fella inspired you to create new things. Oh, I appreciate you. Let's read this another one. How are, how are you doing, my old friends? We all know that I'm the only reason why your new show is any good. Oh, Dr. Soap, you bitch. I know that our last moments weren't so great and we were in a bad situation because of the ideas you have stolen from me. Let's get straight to the deal. You have a few options here. I see you in court or you pay me tributes for my ideas or I'll be your new director. I hope you understand the situation. Everything will be all right. You know what? Bitch, we'll see you in court. I would advise you differently, but the worst vice is advice. Good luck to all of you. Lawyers are the devil's ministry. Well, you know what? I, I think I think we're doing well enough that we can we can handle whatever lawsuit that you try to give to us. I mean, like we're good. We're, we're amazing, in fact. We're great. We're spectacular, even. Greetings, representative of Hyokaiju. My name is Ronald Senpao. I'm the manager at Mad Folks Marketing Agency LLC. We loved your first episode, and we're willing to work for you making your show reach more and more people around the world. This is how our agency works. You pay us a fixed weekly cost and we work converting the audience of your episodes into fans and income. We guarantee you a 15% increase in your audience on every episode. Do we have a deal? It's free for the first week. You know what? I do love me some money. Glad to do business with you. I'm sure you'll love our services and we'll enjoy your new audience levels. Keep on recording. I will do just that. So there's nothing, oh wait, marketing. Okay, so I can change that. Okay, so plus 10%, uh, plus 10, income conversion rate. Magazine articles, outdoor advertising, and celebrity posts. Huh. I'm gonna hold off on using any of these right now and you just go right back into the recording, which is what we're all here for. Perform a team attack with three squad members. Defeat all weak bread crumblers in four turns. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's see if we can actually do that. I love when we use the teleport effect for no reason at all. I do too. Just puffs of smoke. It's just too much fun, isn't it, Deny? I almost forgot, Flashy. You have a dentist appointment today, right? You had a few moments, you know, then I'll have to leave. I'm sorry. No problem. We'll make this as quick as possible. Yeah, we will. Get ready. It's time for the Mingus to get on stage. Grrrr. Grrrr. Suddenly a very human-like alien-esque figure joins the scene. No, you're not supposed to join us right now. We haven't found your hiding place yet. Oh, I'm sorry, folks. I'll pay more attention next time. Appreciate it. A few more minions to the scene would make up for it. Yeah. Prepare yourselves. You need to get rid of these monsters. They're all around you. Don't worry, Lee. Should be easy. Go, Food Wars, go. Okay, so... Okay, that's a weak bread crumbler. We no. Okay, so okay, okay. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. Jump right into the team attacks. Alright. 
I'm gonna go after the weak bread crumbler while I have the time. You will never win. Damn. You bitch. You absolute bitches. Okay. So with you, uh... That's one weak bread crumbler down. Go ahead. Go ahead. And I believe you... Do you technically count? I don't know. But we're gonna figure it out. Go ahead. I only need to do it once. Okay. I'm an idiot, okay? Y'all y'all should know this by now. I'm kind of an idiot. So as long as I get these two out the paint, like within the next uh, two moves, we got that director's uh, cut, right? Oh, you bitch. Wait, is there, is, ah, oh, shit, only needed three of these assholes. Okay. This is, this is why you, this is why reading is fundamental. I only needed three. I'm sitting here doing it with four. There you go. All right, can that bread crumbler get a little, just a little bit closer to me so I can just fuck him up? Yeah, whatever, whatever. Yeah, yeah, punch us all you want. Okay, he's a little bit closer. Okay, who else can reach him? You can't reach him. You can't reach him. Damn it. I might have screwed us. I might have screwed us just a little bit. Let's see if he can get it done. Damn it. I might have lost the plot on this one. I fully accept it. Or I might not be able to count. Is this technically the fourth move? Nope, that was it. That was the fourth turn. Ah, uh, that was my bad. I, I, I made that harder than it needed to be. That was me being an idiot. That was me being an idiot. Only got one of those director uh, notes done. Yeah, we should continue with it in another episode because my dumb ass. Yeah, go ahead, head to the dentist's office to be continued, or will it be? Ah, to build a new story piece. What you gonna do? Why you gotta be a fat alien? Well, <clears throat> actually proceeding with the story. Just to get to a different position, the audience will think we're at a different part of the episode, which is smart. Everybody move, let's get to our new position. Fat alien kidnapped Flashy, then Voodoo Warriors reached its warehouse so they could get their friend back. And it suddenly appears. You shall never see Flashy again. Oh damn, we got multiple of these bitches. He's in good hands. Okay, no, we're about to, we're about to whoop his ass. Then someone else joins the set using the teleport effect. Who are you? My name is Thomas Dahl. I'm Galax Silver, the sixth ranger of the Galax Rangers. Okay. This galactic monster is a threat to us all. To us all! I'll definitely take that. Your line was just too great. Yeah. 
Welcome to our show, Thomas. All right, everyone, keep rolling. Galax Silver, it's nice to see you here. Fed alien kidnapped Flashy. So your last words, obese creep. Damn, why y'all gotta, why y'all gotta, why y'all gotta do dude like that? I do like your outfit. Hit boss every turn. Okay. Can't, uh, I don't know if you can, wait. You can drop that. Hit the boss. There you go. And there you go. And he's out the paint. You bread crumbling ass assholes. All right, time to roll squad. You don't do enough damage to, for me to worry about that. Damn it. Can I get to you to, nope. All right, I'll just get you close. Oh, damn. All right, I'm just gonna sit here and chill. Knocking us back and shit. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do that. Rock the one that's farthest away from me. Right, that shouldn't be enough to kill you. Thank goodness. I just need to get rid of these fucking bread crumblers. Ah, you bitch. Oh, you can hit them. Okay, so. Leader, take them out. Green, take them out. You know what? Since, since you want to be a little, since you want to be a little baby back bitch, damn, I'm gonna, I'm gonna use my Galax Ranger. Thank you. All I need to do is just keep hitting him every turn. That's it. Everybody else, now we can all roll over here and roll this motherfucker in monkey dough. There we go. Yeah, run away. Don't matter. We got you. There we go. Get those director instructions right. I may have screwed up the other one, but at least I got this one. This threat was easy to handle, Voodoo Warriors. Are you gonna stick around? Galax Silver? No need to thank me. You should thank the energized crystal we all channeled. Ooh, sorry, excuse me, Galaxia Force from. But I must leave now. My ship, the Star Road Surfer, awaits me. I bid you good luck on your path, Voodoo Warriors. We need more friends like this one. Yeah, we do. Yeah, me neither. Unless he gets super mad that, like, you know... I hope he doesn't get mad that we, that we basically recorded without him. I hope that's not the case. And we're saved. Your friend, Dave. 
He's got more than 100 followers on microblog, plus 10 fans per episode. He microblogs, spam on social media. Okay. Now we got a part-time accountant. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Outdoor advertising, okay. You know, I'm gonna stick with this one. Yeah, I'm cool with that. Yeah. Oh, that uses fan power, because I'm an idiot. All right, that's what, that's what happens when you don't fully read shit. But another episode in the books, we're gonna do some more of this next time on Button Smash. We'll catch you later, deuces.